Oh, that's a that's a pig. That's a nice one. Dude. All right, here we go. Here we go. He's fat. Hey guys, Chris, the Midwest Bass Hunter. I'm back in Iowa, fishing with my buddy Ryan. That uh, Hi. gentleman right there, he's uh, the master of the drop shot. Uh, <laughs> it's the only thing he does. But uh, we're out here this morning. It's a beautiful morning. It's uh, gonna get hot, at hot, hot today and pretty sticky, I think, but um, we're gonna see what we can do to catch some fish. That was, I wish I'd have had the camera turned around. <laughs> Ryan tried to cast and the bait just, fell right next to the boat um anyways we already been fishing a little bit we caught a few uh doing some different things um but all kind of like slow bottom techniques we tried a couple other things and and the fish are definitely on the bottom i think so we'll see kind of kind of see what the day progresses and and see what we can get done out here came all the way up here to jerk bait fish and i forget my box of jerk baits <laughs> Durr. Durr. i'm gonna throw a chatterbait real quick and see if I can pull one out of the grass but they're fish following my bait all the time yeah when they get close enough to the boat they're like nah I don't think so right exactly and that was in deep water there's a fish cranking one up on the chatterbait barely even ate it man I mean I didn't feel him at all it's a pizzle Pizzled my nizzle. Look at him. Get off of there now. You can't shake them off for the life. Get of off of it. He's hooked perfectly, dude. Yeah, he is. Look at that. Right through the snout. Right through the beak. The snout. He could have been a 50 pounder and you landed him. Come here, little dude. Let's be friends. <laughs> ah, there we go. Perfect release. Catch and de release. Stupid pike. I wonder if he bit up everything. Oh, I'd love it if it was a smallie. Catch a smallie on a jig. I've never done that. Oh, you're over me. Sorry. This is a good fish, I think. It's probably a pike. <laughs> I had him. I didn't realize. God, he's heavy as heck, dude. He ain't that big, but... That's a nice fish. That little crawdad colored jig. That's a chunk, dude. That's a two and a half pounder. I was like, sweet, no one's out here. Let's go hit that. It it's always got bass fishermen on it. I've never, and I, you know, it's weird because you never spot I've ever fished. And it's probably just dumb with me. Oh, nice. Look at this guy. He's out around the fall, didn't he? Dude, I was just sitting there and he was just swimming off on it. No. It's a nice fat one. Yeah. Whoa, buddy, come on. You ain't that big. Dude, they weigh. They weigh a little bit. On the jig. Look at that. That's how you want to you hook him right there. That that oh, I like tore him up. Easy. Dude, I hooked him there and pulled it through. That's what you're supposed to do. Already? Shaky snake. This would work great as a wacky rig, too. Oh, Hopefully that. Which direction might I need to cast anywhere? Hopefully that... Um, Look at that little shiny tail. Ooh, will uh, attract the smallmouth type. One, one would hope. Oh, ho, 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 first pass <laughs> with that bad boy. What you got there, Chris? What is it be? Oh, look at that. It's a nice little largemouth. 
sure. Get out of the motor. <laughs> that's shaky snake, dude. I love that bait. I like the tail on that. That's nice. That's real nice. Oh, look at that fat. Jeez. What a chunk. Dude, I'm bleeding these fish out today. <laughs> Dude, I'm just hooking them good. Look at that. That is a chunk. That is a nice fish, Ryan. Look how dark he is. That's a pretty, pretty fish. Let's let this guy go. But I like your theory of why they might not be. Because of the lightning. I know, it's amazing. Stocky. Yeah, stocky little large. <laughs> He's bigger than 15 incher. No, he's <laughs> freaking. This is reminiscent. <laughs> this is like when we were in South Carolina, <laughs> North Carolina. Dude, I wish I'd have recorded that. I turned it off. He's been stuck in the tongue before. Yep. Oh, that's a chunk right there. Dude, they're all so fat in here. That's crazy. Look at that. That is a nice fish. That might be a little bit bigger than the last one. I think so. longer. So I caught a couple fish on this shaky head. This is a Berkeley Fusion shaky head. I think it's maybe a quarter ounce. Maybe it's an eighth ounce, I'm not sure. And then I got this Berkeley shaky snake on there. And it's green pumpkin. It's got this little chartreuse tail. Um, you can see it's real thin where this ribbing is or whatever you want to call it. So it's got a lot of action when you shake it. Shake it, shake it. Um, fishing this with, uh, I got a lose Mach 2 speed spool, I think. Yeah, Mach 2. 6.2 to 1 gear ratio, and then I've got a Berkeley E-Motion. This is actually a drop shot rod, I believe. Uh, 6.9 medium, <coughs> medium with fast tip. Love this rod, and this reel, this is a, this reel I've had forever, and it just works. Look at this, this, I'm gonna put this on a shaky head. This could be the dumbest thing ever. <laughs> I like that little thing. It called? Um, it doesn't have a name. The Crazy Hick Bait Company. Crazy Hick. Some Crazy Hick made them. We're gonna try it. I mean, whatever. I don't know. Curious. Well, we've caught them there before. Yeah. Every time I fish there with you, though, I just catch pike. Right, right. <laughs> That was the day when I had three bites on a, on a retrieve and then the pike finally ate it like 10 feet from the boat. I'm like, he, and you're like, was that really a fish? And I'm like, yeah, dude, he was a fighting. Dude, he was swimming around with it forever. I was like, what is that? I couldn't tell. I think it's a small jaw. He's, like He's fighting like a head shaking son of a gun. Oh! Get the net. Dude, on the crazy hick bait company. Isn't that crazy? Weird creature bait. That could be your PB smallmouth right there, buddy. That's a nice one. That's a real nice one. <laughs> I hope I got him hooked good. <laughs> We ain't ready to give up the ghost just yet, I can tell you that. Dude, that's like an 18, 19 inch. Oh, that's a, that's a pig, dude. That's a nice one. Dude. All right, here we go, here we go. He's fat. I don't think it's quite as big as I thought, but no, he's a nice he's one. He's fat. Dude, Crazy Hick Bait Company. 
Dude, look at that thing. That's a chunk. <laughs> That's fun. Get I think we ought to measure him. I agree. Dude, I, had him, I could have let him swim for the rest of the year. Yeah. Look at that. What a freaking tub. It's like a 17 and a half inch. Look how bad he Dude, I'm not feeling him eat it. No, like I, he was swimming around. It's, I tell you, I think it's the whole, the whole thing of the, the weather last night. Look at that, brown bass. What a pretty fish. The weather last night has got him kind of all slowed down. They're eating there. though. Yeah. <laughs> okay guys, so I have this bait. I had a bag of these baits and I'm never using them for anything, although they might work as a decent little punch bait or a jig trailer or something. So I thought, what the heck, I'm gonna throw that on there uh, on a shaky head, first cast, and he eats it. Tore the bait up though, it's definitely not a bait that's gonna work for multiple fish on a shaky head, but. swimming at me. I almost couldn't keep up with him. <laughs> I don't know, but it's a good one. Yeah. Yes. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Came off? Sorry. Oh, dude, that was bigger than the last one. It was, one. wasn't it? Son of a... Oh, you didn't do nothing. <laughs> Dang it, dude. That was a horse. Isn't that crazy? The way a fish like that come out of the water? Damn it. I I I should have tried harder to keep him down. Yes, that was my plan. Dude, that dude's chucking like a big white spinnerbait or something in his Maybe. P row. Maybe he's muscle fishing. People do that. It's Kai Jack. Come on, water. There he is. <laughs> I think it's a brownie. No, it's a largemouth. He's just angry. He was. He had the right He's got all them teeth, but he ain't got no toothbrush. <laughs> Ooh, look, he's blind. He's blind. Blinded by the light. Yeah, somebody stuck a freaking jig up through his eyeball. Jig through the eye. Fish number several. That was on the Max Scent General. On the shaky head. The shaky head. Your fish like, that's a good fish, Ryan. That's a nice fish. Nice job, dude. Both with the three pounders. Dude, that is a three pounder, for real. You finally got a real three pounder. <laughs> that's the biggest largey of the day. Biggest fish of the day, probably. Probably, nice. nice. He was chewing on it, huh? That's what happened to me earlier. And you don't want to jack it into the dock and then have it. I think it's a small mouth. Dude, that's a small mouth. Isn't it? That's a small jaw. A small jaw flipping docks. I'm going to lose him. <laughs> it's a Seaguar Red Label that did it. Dude, I set him right on the seat. <laughs> that was dumb. That's a nice one too. That is a nice smallie right there. On the jig. That is the first smallmouth I've ever caught on a jig. That's a nice fish. He's a good one. Dude, I love this. This trailer is not jacked up at all. Yeah, that's it. Quit it. All right, here we go. All right guys, so I put together a new combo for for kind of flipping and skipping around docks because um, my other jig combos were like seven foot or longer and I kind of struggled with that. It was too long of a rod, so I went to something a little shorter. This is a six foot extra fast, medium heavy rod. It's an all-star jig rod. I don't even know if they make these anymore, but I got this actually from an outlet store. It was a salesman, what do you call those? Salesman sample? Yeah. And I got a Lose Custom Pro on there. Or not a Custom Pro, Lose Custom Speed Spool. That's an 8.3 to one. 
And then I've got 20 pound fluorocarbon and it's red, it's Seaguar red label and I don't like it guys. I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> I struggle with it. It really just, it's really stiff line. All right guys, that is gonna do it. We're off the lake, we're in Ryan's truck. It's a real big unit. It's a, it's a large SUV pulling this boat. Uh, we had a good day out there today, just junk fishing. Uh, we're not, uh, either of us very good at flipping docks and, and stuff like that, and we had a little bit of success there, uh, which was cool, so we enjoyed that. And uh, I caught that smallie on the dock. That was kind of cool. I've never done that. Never caught a smallie on a jig, so that was that was fun. And uh, yeah, just a great day out there. Really beautiful in the morning, and it got pretty warm, but not bad. A lot of crazy boat traffic, so we said, the heck with it, we're done. We're getting out of here, so. Uh, if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. Hit that little bell down there so you don't miss anything. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.